Welcome back to the Good Old Boys channel. Cummins build part two coming at you. So guys, this is a field truck. Yeah! Or what's left of it anyways. This is about three and a half hours worth of work of um, just tearing this thing down. And we're basically almost down to a bare frame except the suspension, gearbox for the steering, fuel tank, and then the leaf springs. And it'll be a bare frame. And then, of course, you can see we have um, quite a few of the parts, the cab and engine and transmission are out back. So we actually ended up taking the frame to get it sandblasted. So that's what you guys will see in this next clip. Hopefully this turns out for you guys. The speaker on my phone is pretty well trashed from water. So uh, this is part of the Cummins build. This is the frame that got sandblasted, at least the front half. You can see what it looks like after sandblasting. And then this is after painting, which this is clear uh, POR 15. And then all the nooks and crannies yeah. using this POR 15. It's looking good. So guys, this is what's left of the field truck here. <laughs> um, this is a truck that's a parts truck for the Cummins over there, of course. So what he's trying to do with this thing is actually try and use the back half of this frame section, which is in a lot better shape than his uh, frame. You guys probably don't know, but he took the front half of his uh, third frame. So we have, <laughs> I guess that's one thing we got to explain here. So we have three frames actually. So we have the frame under that truck. We bought another truck that was just a frame and a bed. And we also have the field truck that's right here that we've stripped for parts. But um, so anyways, the front half of the truck with the bed on it is taken to a frame or to a sandblaster. We'd be using this frame um, other than the fact that obviously it's two wheel drive and the fact that it has frame damage, which um, kind of hard to see for you guys. Here you go, you can kind of see the frame right here. Yeah, so the frame is all creased up right here. This frame is in really bad shape. So he took the front half of the good frame to the sandblaster. He's just having that sandblasted. He's using the back half of this frame because it's already in really good shape, as you can see. Again, this is a Southern truck from Kentucky, if you guys didn't already know. But progress is being made right now. He's getting these brackets off and splitting the frame, which has these terrible rivets in it that he can't seem to get out. So that's the uh, the Cummins progress update so far. That side and head off. Yeah. So this is the other, the back half of the frame that he's using here is just cleaning up the rust between the parts that are gonna bolt together. So we never really clarified, but we have three truck frames. So we have the truck frame under the Cummins itself. We have the field truck frame, which is right here. He's using the back half of that. That's a Southern truck frame or Southern truck. So the back half of the frame doesn't need cleaned up much. As you guys can see, this is the factory paint on it. You saw him grinding these lower spots here uh, in the video earlier. So that's cleaning up really well. So this is the third truck frame and this just came from some random truck. He actually ended up getting this sandblasted and as you guys can see, it's dried with the clear coat um, POR 15 and it's looking really good. Well, boys, I think we sent her a little too hard. So in this last video, you guys can tell that the Cummins has pretty much completely had it. The frame 
wherever it was um, splitting or separating is completely split basically. So the Cummins is sitting there, you know, one side like this, other side like that. And that's exactly the reason why we're actually replacing the frames. That's the update for now on the Cummins 2500. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. Check out the description box below for more truck videos, and we'll catch you guys on the next video. Peace.